In this lesson, we're going to add tabs. Now, tabs provide a great way for you to put in, you know, several content on the same section. So let me demonstrate what that means. So I'm just going to put in here my tabs. And then this is where you can add the tabs. So this is tab one. If you want to put an icon, I'm just going to grab this icon here. And then you can put in the content for this particular tab. And I'm just going to copy this and then copy it one more time. So now let me change this to tab two. And I can change the icon. And you can change the text as well and then change this to tab three. Okay, so once you've changed those tabs, then you have the option here of selecting how you want the tabs to be displayed. So this is the style for it. So let's flip the default and see what that looks like. And then you can come back and make some changes to it. Then you want to click on save. Now that it has been completely completed, you click on view page and then you have the tabs. So this is the default tab. So let's come back here. If you want to change the style for it, let's do that. So where it says style for tabs, let's click on the pills. So once that's successfully saved, let's refresh the page. And you notice now that it has the, you know, the highlighted buttons over each tab. So this is great if you have, uh, you know, a lot of content that you want to present, but you don't want it to take, take up so much space. All you have to do is create tabs to, you know, to organize it, you know, accordingly. 